All right, guys, so I have a lip sync party that I'm going to. It's an annual lip sync party. I really should have been a little more prepared for it, but I've been really busy this week and trying to get a lot of other things done. Today I'm doing a whole course all day. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna get back and have to be ready for this lip sync party that I'm not ready for. So I have been practicing in the car all day. I just went on my lunch break from this course to go get a wig because I think I have decided what I'm gonna be, okay? It was a toss up between MC Hammer. Can't touch this. Can't, can't touch, touch this. this. And D Light. Oh, this is in the heart. These were my two thoughts. Maybe I was thinking Vanilla Ice, Ice Ice Baby, but um, he's not, he doesn't dance as much as the other two. So it was between MC Hammer and D Light. I've gone with D Light just because that's what the costume shop had. They had, well, nothing but a wig, really. There's nothing in costume shops right now. I really missed it here. I should have gone right after Halloween, but I didn't. So I went to Party City. I found, it's a Paradise City wig kit, actually, but I can just not wear the bandana and put a maybe a headband and try and look like Miss Delight. I will look like her in this, I think. I have to find some D lovely outfit. How do you say? Some colorful, I know I have white go-go boots, so that'll be good. Don't ask, I don't know. I just have high white go-go boots on hand, but I need to find like some like de lovely outfit. I don't know, like some crazy 70s looking thing. Maybe I'll try and go to Value Village later or somewhere that might have, where would have that? Who has that? Anyways, in the meantime, I'm just looking crazy in my car, lip syncing to Groove is in the Heart and dancing. I think people think I'm nuts, but that's okay. It's all gonna be worth it tonight for my performance. I'm kind of terrified to do a solo. I don't know, I've never done a solo. I mean, I was Axl Rose once, but my son helped me out. He was Slash, so I felt like it wasn't really a solo. I was with someone on stage. So believe it or not, I'm such a performer and I'm a dancer and I'm a YouTuber, all this stuff, but I am very, very uh, shy to do a solo performance at a lip sync party. Now I love karaoke. <laughs> I can be bad at karaoke and be happy, but lip syncing is a whole other thing. It's such a performance and you need to know the words. That's why I thought, number one, find a song that I know every word to and that will make it a lot easier, right? Then just dance around and get a great costume and you're good. When you don't know the words, it can get a little like you feel not confident. So last year I did Millie Vanilli. <laughs> I knew most of the words, but there were a few moments where I was like, oh my God, what? You think you know it and then you don't. With karaoke, you can just read the words. It's awesome. And you can be bad in karaoke. It's not like you've practiced, but lip sync. You gotta be good, man. So, um, looking forward to the party tonight, looking forward to relax, have a good time, see everyone, bring it. I'm sure everyone else has been working on their pieces like for weeks. I have not. Anyways, back to practicing in my car on my lunch hour. So I'm trying to cram like a whole lot of practicing into a few hours driving in the car. <laughs> Cramming as much practice as I can and thinking about all the dancing I'm gonna do. Like she did a lot of groovy dancing. So um, yeah, I used to dance to this song as a child and sing it a lot. So I feel like it's gonna go well, maybe. Um, maybe not, but we'll see. And you know, I think the key to doing a good lip sync is either picking like someone really interesting that does a lot of interesting things or just doing a really committed performance, even if the person's not that interesting, if you really commit to your character, even if they're not that interesting a character or kind of boring, you can make them, you know, you be them so much that it's interesting. So I'm trying to do it all. Lots of dancing and entertainment, lots of commitment 
to my character and she is a very interesting character that wears interesting things. I'm just not sure if I'm going to find the interesting things like in a half an hour on my way home right now, but I have the hair, I have the boots. I feel like that is a really good base. Hopefully I can find some sort of, I don't know, colorful thing to wear. I'm not going to wear like the little hot pants that she wears in the video. <coughs> I might try and find like a unitard looking thing in some bright colors. I could pull that off maybe. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to figure it out. I wish I had figured this out yesterday. That would have been really awesome of me, but I didn't. So I'm working with what I got. Here we go. And in the meantime, if I happen to find hammer pants and glasses and wig and stuff, I would become MC Hammer, no problem. Um, so we'll see. I'm keeping my options open. We'll see what happens. Pretty sure I'm going to be D-Light. I'm practicing her song in the car. Groove is in the heart. Here we go. Okay, what do you think? It looks great. You look like you could do anything in this outfit. But like, you look like you could be any awesome act. Like, I really like this look. I don't know about the chest hair, but I like you everything like the chest else. Hair? I like it. I can take it off and have the tank top. <laughs> 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 